Hi there. Uh, so I'm talking over the gameplay footage that you're seeing right now. I thought it would be better than, you know, just having gameplay here that's just edited to the good parts, I guess. Uh, so lately I have not been making that much videos as I used to. Uh, I kind of just lost motivation, but also I've been really busy with other stuff that takes up a good part of my day. Not too much, but it's college and it's just exhausting because after you're done you don't really want to do anything else. Uh, making videos is kind of a chore. Like, it's not that it's not fun to do, it is kind of fun to do, but to have a uh, upload schedule, it's just, you know, not that fun. <laughs> like, after I'm done a class, I'm like, alright, I don't want to do anything that requires effort. I just play video games. Uh, by the way, I really like the way how this map looks now. I think I already said that, but at the gate, they changed the gates and just the whole graphics, it, the atmosphere is so good. I love like the blue sky and the fog and just the walls, the trees, just the whole environment looks great. The old Dead by Daylight graphics kind of had some kind of dull charm to them, but while I will kind of miss it, I missed it at first. Uh, I think this is ultimately better. Oh, you better be sneaky, Claudette. On top of college, I'm also working now. And <laughs> that has taken up a lot of time of my weeks. So, college and work just take up a lot, a, lo a lot of my time. And, yeah, just doing anything else is kind of... Mm, undesirable like make, like making videos however in the winter I believe I will not be having college classes the next time will be in the spring unless the classes go through winter they might but yeah I'll still have work but I might have enough time to make videos more often if I want to. Uh, there are a couple videos or types of videos that, that I was supposed to upload or supposed to make. One of that being the Super Donkey 64 Iceberg video. Uh, that video was originally complete but I stuttered and messed up so many times I just want to make a script for it. Oh, that was sneaky. Uh, I might continue it. It might be cancelled. My heart is not 100% sure yet. Also, lately, I haven't been working on Roblox Studio or <laughs> Microsoft Paint. Oh, no. Uh, yeah, I haven't been using those lately because while I have a new PC, the thing is... The laptop that I work on, the mouse is, I think the left click is broken, so trying to draw or trying to do something on Roblox Studio will uh, always trigger something that I didn't want to click. Like I think it's like usually a double click that happens or when I uh, try to draw in paint it doesn't hold down all the way so you don't get like a regular line hopefully you know what I'm talking about it's kinda hard to explain not really 
Um, I do have a new PC though that I use to play Dungeons and Dragons online, which is one of the best games of all time, one of my favorite games of all time. Uh, I could use paint on there. Mm, it it'll probably be okay. Uh, downloading Roblox on there in Roblox Studio. I don't know, it's kind of hard to decide because I looked it up and downloading Roblox from its from its uh, regular website, roblox.com, it shouldn't add any viruses, and I guess Roblox Studio won't add any viruses either, but I just have that bad feeling that something bad is going to happen to the computer and it's going to run slower. And, of course, it's going to run slower because it, it's having more... You know, stuff on there, not just Dungeons and Dragons online. Uh, but mm, I still don't really trust Roblox or Roblox Studio. Maybe it's not like a virus that happens; it's just the type of computer and the data take up. Yeah. <laughs> Let's see what else. So I do want to kind of start drawing in Microsoft Paint again, or any other uh, free drawing program. <laughs> uh, I guess we'll have to see. I could use my uh, PC to upload the videos too. It'd probably be easier. I think YouTube has its own video editing software on its website. Uh, let's see, what else? Oh yeah, also I discovered that all major chocolate companies rely on slave and child labor to collect coca for their chocolate. And, <laughs> yeah, I know this is like sudden, like bad news, but... I want to try to find like slave free alternatives. There's this one chocolate bar called Tony's Chocolate Only. While it is a stupid name, like it tries not to use slave or child labor for its chocolate, so I've been trying to find it. I heard you can find it at a Walgreens or a CVS. How did that not hit? But yeah, my quest for slave-free chocolate continues, and I try not to buy any chocolate products from that point on when I found out about the whole slave and child labor thing. Double hit. Uh, I guess that's it for now, and I guess we'll see what happens in the future. Goodbye, and thank you for watching.